Hello, everybody. This is Val. With this is how we do it. Hi, everybody. This is Val. With this is how you do it. I'm trying to shoot this video to y'all and see if it make it through. Just got out the shower, wash my hair. Um, only thing on it is conditioner. That's it. And I'm going to put some coconut oil. Right at the grocery store. Some of you don't know where to find it. You can find it at Walmart. Um, I'm just going to open it too. It's breaking the seal. And I'm going to apply some to my hair. Well, rings uh, might be a, a task, but I'm just going to put some on it. Hopefully, by uh, being new, there's no crunchiness. You know how if you, if it melt, then it start get that settlement in it, like the um the um little white pieces be in it. My hair likes the coconut oil, so I'm just trying to put it through there, get it in there. Then I'll put some on this back layer back here. Get, let me get it. Put some more on it because that don't feel like it's enough. all back in my hair. I went several weeks in that protective style, style like the ponytail. And so I'm trying to replenish my hair with the oil. And I thought I'll come on camera because I hadn't been on here on a in a while, and hopefully this video will make it to y'all. If not, I'll try a different video tomorrow. Hopefully this one will make it. So just, this is, has plenty of oil in it. I'm real generous with my oil because my hair loves, 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 loves oil. I'm not trying to do a wash and go or anything like that. I could if I put some gel on it, then it'll curl up and define even more. But I don't think that's my deal today. Let y'all see my routine on applying oil. It's nothing to it. Just put it on there, y'all. I don't have this great big ritual about doing things. This is the way I'm doing it today. The thing is about this is that I want it to be rubbed in. At this point, the LOC or the lock method, some you would put a cream on it to uh, magnify your curls. I 
think I'm just going to put it back in the rubber band again. The hair needs moisture, needs oil. I don't think it necessarily needs the gel. The gel just is for when you want to really make it slick down and have curls and all of that good stuff. I got a little bit more Hawaiian silky left. I think I just rubbed that on my hands and put it on there. You know how Hawaiian silk ain't nothing but another form of grease. That defines curls. I'm out, out of it. I'm going to have to pick some more up next time I make it to the hair store. Some good smelling stuff too. You see the difference already has has doing. Yeah. Go ahead and use all of this Hawaiian silky. I'm getting it for the oil. Yeah, that's enough. It might be, y'all, but I can't see it. I think I'll put the shower cap on my head and let this Hawaiian silky soak in my hair. And that will help with the definition of my curls and my hair receiving more moisture and it, it getting locked in after this wash. I'll probably put the rag, uh, like I say, the shower cap on next. And just let it sit. You call that the uh, hydration hydration method, I think. Sleep in it. The shower cap or or the grocery bag. I'm rubbing in that whiteness now because I could see that it wasn't rubbed in. You have to rub it. Give it that praying palm and all of that. But like I say, I'm not going through those changes right now. I'm not going anywhere. By being a housewife, you know, I just say I'm going to put my hair back like this. Make Just make sure that I take care of it every now and then to keep, to keep it curly. Because it's, it's at this awkward stage now where my straight hair is still straight. And the longer you get, I know it's just going to be better. So I'm gonna, I'm letting it grow, grow on out. It, it's the length it's supposed to be for the time that I've been natural also. Not quite four years. It won't be four years until March. 
and it's it's December now. Don't look like I brought the little band in here, but I do have one that was left from before, so I'm gonna put that one on here. It don't matter which for man do it. <laughs> as long as you don't leave your rubber bands on it for days, you you uh take it off, do something to your hair, and then uh I just got this on here from my hair uh shedding. The rubber band didn't do that, y'all. I just did that myself, so let me wipe my hands off. So I won't think none. I had shit. I uh, snatched it out. By this being slick, it will slip off my hair when I do take it off because my hair is greasy. When your hair grow, your re your routine changes. Like I said, I'll probably never press my hair. I would probably will. Maybe after four or five years. Probably won't last uh, more than a. I don't know how long it'll last. I guess as long as it lasts, huh? But sometimes, you know, we get impatient and we put the curls back in there because we just love the curls. Y'all want to see that? And then I'm going to get off this thing. And I'll talk to you guys later. It didn't cut off, so you're going to get this one. This is Val. This is how you do it. Apply an ore to a hair. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye now.